In the last decade, artificial intelligence has gone from a science fiction dream to a critical part of our everyday lives. We use AI systems to interact with our phones through Siri and Alexa. Cars like Tesla's interpret and analyze their surroundings to intelligently drive themselves. Amazon monitors our browsing habits and intelligently serves us up products it thinks we'd like to buy. Even Google decides what kind of search results to give us based on who it thinks we are. Artificially intelligent algorithms are here, but this is only the beginning. Because in the future, AI is going to change everything. But do we want it to? Well, what exactly is artificial intelligence? Maybe a better question might be, what exactly is intelligence? The simplest descriptor is collecting data about the world and using that data to make predictions in the short and long term. That applies to both people and machines. So when we talk about AI in our lives, we're talking about everything from a computer being able to read a handwritten document like an OCR reader to a robot performing complex surgery on its own, even to a massive database categorizing your personality based on what you've written and looked at online. Because the world of AI is so incredibly large, let's take a look at some of the most groundbreaking developments we expect to see in the very near future, and whether that's a step forward or backward for society. First and foremost, AI systems are already primed to take over thousands, if not millions of jobs. Any job that consists of a human taking down information from other humans and inputting it into a system is likely to go obsolete. So cashiers, receptionists, telemarketers, and bank tellers are all on their way out. As self-driving cars, self-operating drones, and other conveyors from A to B get more complex, we'll also lose jobs like truck drivers, postal workers, courier services, even pizza delivery. Factories are also becoming fully automated. So are car washes and movie theaters. Even my job as a journalist is threatened by rapidly improving news algorithms that can gather information and deliver it faster and more accurately. But as society changes to accommodate an all machine service world, it'll also open up new jobs for the next generation. Writing software, repairing and maintaining robots, and developing new and better systems. Most notably, machines are also primed to take over dangerous jobs. Firefighting, mining, deep sea oil drilling, construction, and other careers with high mortality rates will be replaced by machines that can't get sick or hurt. We don't know what an all AI workforce will look like yet, but many economists believe that the world might be a brighter and more rewarding place with machines taking over the more dull and hazardous jobs. As we develop better AI, we're discovering that it can not just replace human labor, but also think in ways that humans can't. Algorithms that can monitor and process massive amounts of information and make conclusions based on patterns in that data are poised to change every avenue of society. Starting from something small, like optimizing traffic patterns over time to figure out the best routes to take, or how to fix roads and rebuild highways, all the way to something much more serious, like monitoring epidemics and disease and stopping them before they spread. Machine learning has even shown to analyze human behavior and predict warning signs by recognizing common language used by people like sexual predators or terrorists and alerting law enforcement to take action. Then again, that same technology can be used to track down political dissidents or serve fake news to vulnerable people while blocking out competing opinions and information. Just a few tech monopolies control the latest breakthroughs in data collecting, processing, and analyzing. And while we may hope that AI will help advance our society, it may just end up working to benefit the tech industry and only those who can afford to take advantage of cheaper, smarter human replacements. Maybe to the detriment of society. But for now, we just don't know what the future of AI holds.